Hey everyone, happy Friday. It's Friday the 13th. We've got some really high winds in um, Oklahoma today. We are, um, Western Oklahoma is battling severe fires and um, high winds and I was a little worried about my connection but it looks like I'm on here. Hi, Miss Margie. How's everything in Western Oklahoma, honey? The smoke has made it this way, and um, it's well. As you, I'm, I'm, I'm certainly not going to complain in my area, but we're we're seeing it. We're smelling it. It's just severe. You guys pray for Oklahoma and the the uh, fires. Whew, it's bad. We need some rain. Get some rain up in here. Yeah, it's smoky, Margie. I can just imagine. You guys, welcome. It's Friday Night Live. It's April 13th, um, and we've got something fun tonight. Um, thank you for joining. You guys know the drill. Um, Q is going to be up here and with me in just a moment. Hi, everyone. This is going to be a really special show, so please spread the word. Um, we are going to be doing a paint pour on our canvases tonight. Debbie Beard with Debbie's Design Diary released a new video on Tuesday and she used all DIY paints and she did a paint pour on a chair, like her wooden office chair and it turned out fantastic if you have not seen that video. Um, I would love for you to watch it after this one. Um, hi Q! My girl's here, and um, maybe we could have someone link that video, or if Debbie pops on here, maybe she could tag it. But I want to make sure you guys all watch that video. But we both watched it. I promise we watched it. Okay, we had a little mishap with the with the chair, you know, this chair I'm sitting in that I painted. Um, we had a little mishap, but we're not going to have that again because we're going to get this paint pour down. Although, um, she did it a certain way. Everybody has done it a certain way, right? Well, she figured out a way to do it with DIY paint, and she also added in Golden Ticket. Um, I know in San Diego, you California people, you are very familiar with those wildfires. I am. I, I have actually explained that to my sons today. I said, you guys deal with this every year. Um, okay, guys, so... I am going to announce our new retailers, but let's do that. Um, I want to get this paint thing going because I'm not sure how long it's going to take to set up. So, oh, you posted her YouTube video. You're awesome. Nobody leave. This is for after. This is the after show on that YouTube link right there. Debbie's Design Diary. Um, if you have not caught one of her videos, you're going to want to because you're going to be missing out if you if you don't, okay? Hi, everybody. Thank you for being here. Um, we've got big things coming up, so we're going to get Q on here right now um, and start talking about it. Um, I've got my, um, you've got tornado warnings. Lord, Lord have mercy, please. Um, I've got my online class coming up Sunday. You've got one more day if you have not signed up for my online class. Got one more day, and I'm adding Q to the broadcast now. For FNL, hashtag, I wanna see your hashtag FNL. Spread the word. You guys know how much we love you guys and your support, and we have so much fun. Don't we have so much fun? Melissa Overland, you won your paint on the DIY page. I hope you clicked over and saw that. Um, thank you, I appreciate you so much. Um, Q, I'm sending you your signal. You're taking a little longer than normal. It's making me nervous. There she is. There she is. I don't know what I'm looking at, sister. Are you there? I'm here. Hold on, baby. I, I had to fix something. Okay. Oh, that's okay. Take all the time. I just needed to hear your voice. Hello, darling. What are you wearing on your cute, cute self? What, what, what are we doing? I, I got creative during a dry time and... I absolutely love my little Chevy truck that I had Me done too. on my bedding last week. But I decided to hand paint my little Chevy truck and my windmill, my pretty flowers on a denim three pocket adult apron. Goes all the way down to about half of my thigh. I know I'm being loud. There's a train, so I'm thinking I have to be really loud. You're fine. Anyway, and anyway, it's really just cute and I hand painted it and I'm gonna sell 30. So if you guys want them, I'm selling 30, hand painted. Hey, this is not a copy. I thought those, I saw those 
earlier, and I thought those were printed on there. No. You're hand painted. This is 30 of them? Yes. You're awesome. Yes. These are exclusive pieces of art on your apron. You're awesome. That is brilliant. Yes, and then I put all I put all shab down on my little truck. Oh, you wrote it on <laughs> there like your logo? Yes. That, you know, like Sanford and Son and uh yeah. I know, yeah, I know. I know that song. That's that's really and so cute. this little What's really funny is this little, I had to tie it up because it kind of hangs, like, see how far it hangs down? Oh, yeah. So it can be longer, like, if you have, if you're chestier. I'm not. Right? I'm not. I'm good. But, but, but some people might be. <laughs> and so then you can just tie it in a little knot if you want it to be a little higher. Yes, yes. So. Oh, come on. Yeah. Oh, hi. I love that. Everybody loves that idea. Now, so do you have a cue tonight, or I know you've been super busy. A cue. It's too much smoke in the air, sister. I'm sorry. Are you okay? I know that's oh, that's freaky. I am fine. I just hate to complain when the whole state of Oklahoma and the Western is, you know, now over there. I, I'm not complaining. I'm not. Um, I know. So I know. Do you have a Betty? I don't have a Betty. I didn't have a chance to do a Betty. I'm actually working on a really special Betty. So hopefully, am I fuzzy? Just a minute. Am I blurry? Just for a minute. Well, why is it doing that? It's the smoke. <laughs> I don't have any smoke. I don't know why it's blurry. I don't like that. It'll fix it. Fix. It'll fix. Put your, put your canvas, put something up in front of it. We're, don't, don't be pushing, but there you are, sister. Okay. Okay, so you don't have a Betty, so maybe we need to do something in honor of Betty. So. I did. I did. Oh, well, you, of course, you did. I was going to say we can do some trivia or something, but, you know. Well, you can do that, too. Go for it. Let's go. Okay, well, I got to be. Okay. <laughs> you got some ideas? Well, I, you got some questions? You put me on the spot. Um, okay, so Did in I? honor of Betty, when, and this new apron, let's do some Betty trivia. For those of you that, um, we're going to start our paint pour in just a second. Um, we've got to be mixing some colors, but um, I'm going to say, who knows the name of the very first Betty by Q? What was the name of the very first Betty? I'm sorry, my, my list is like way up. That's okay. okay. You guys go what ahead and type it? in your answer if you know. Um, I'm curious what some of you have to say. So we're going to start. Um, thank you for the hearts and the shares because y'all are my, my most favorite people. What you drinking? Just just tea. Just tea. Got you. Um, Little tea. Okay, so did you watch Debbie's video really well this time? Yes. I watched it a couple. I watched it two times. You did? Uh-huh. So, okay. I don't want to have an episode like the chairs. However, I the really feel like we, we knew how to do it. Well, we had some major technical difficulties, uh -huh. too. Uh -huh. I mean, I was in a garage. I was coming back from Houston. There was all kinds of technical malfunctioning happening. Yeah, that's right. And that's not our fault. That's right. Okay, so listen, you guys, y'all got, first of all, let's talk, we got to have them sharing tonight, okay? We really need them sharing our video tonight. So, um, I don't, I don't really have a lot of time to give things away. <laughs> I'm terrible. Terrible. At what? But I'm going to give away, I'm going to give away a pixie paintbrush tonight. You are? I so. I am. So listen, if we get, we got to get over a hundred shares at least, right? That's nice. So if we get a hundred shares, I'm going to randomly pick somebody who made a comment on here. Okay? okay. To do my paintbrush. And I've got, I'm going to put in an envelope tonight and put your name on it. You better send me your address. And I'll nag her too. Okay. I'll nag her too. She gets her done. I promise. I promise. Yeah, I will take a picture of it and post it right here on Dion's page. I'll send it. <laughs> Terrible. I don't like the post office. You don't I like them, them, but I don't like going. Yeah. Ain't no, ain't no, but you need a, you need a post office driver who can drive, 
drive stuff back and forth. I know. Well, I have discovered that I can have them pick up all of my packages sure. here at at your place. Yes. Yeah, you just make this little spreadsheet when you go to send all your deliveries out, and they come pick it up, they scan it, and they're gone. But I have, yes. I have to make a spreadsheet. That's no, you don't. You just go on to the USPS.com and you register. You do all your shipping labels through that. They print off one sheet for you. They scan it. They oh. take your packages. Oh, yes, I'm familiar. It's with like that. a bolt. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, absolutely. Um, yes. Annette said that Betty was seventeen ninety nine for the first one. She wasn't. That wasn't. Was that the question? Was no, that the question? No, the question is, what's the name of the first Betty? Everybody's saying Betty goes to Paris. No? Okay, okay we're going to keep watching. Okay. All right. Okay. So, so in, what are we doing? In Debbie's video, keep in mind, Debbie with Debbie's Design Diary made a new video. She has 150,000 followers on YouTube because she's funny, and she shares all kinds of tips and tricks about DIY paint and how to... Um, just DIY everything in your house. So she made a new one and she took this $5 chair that she got from Pottery Barn. Um, actually it was a garage sale, but it was originally from Pottery Barn. Um, and she put a paint pour on the stinking chair. It's brilliant. It looks like it should be $350, right Q? Yeah, it's like, it looks, it looks amazing. She did a great job. So I hope that we can do a good job. So we did not succeed. Um, you know, we didn't get an A on the last project we tried from Debbie's Design Diary, and so... I don't even know if we got an E for effort. She, yes, we did. I gave myself an E and you an E because we tried so hard that night. I mean, I'm sitting in my we chair do. right now, and it's not crunchy. Mine's fine. I sit in it. Mine day. is fine. See, I'm and I've painted, two other, I've painted two other chairs also. Yeah. I have. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Okay, you guys, keep sharing, keep sharing. We gotta get it to 100, 100. So you win Pixie Paintbrush. Okay, they're very valuable. Yes, hello, Kenise. What we're doing tonight is a paint pour. We're gonna try out Debbie's newest paint pour video with DIY paint. So the first thing we need are cups and we need to use the liquid patina or just some sort, you know, the clear liquid patina or, um, what do you, I'm using Big Top because that's all I have. I'm using the clear liquid patina. It's a little milky looking, but it turns clear when it dries. I can't so. believe I'm already changing the recipe. I told you I cannot follow recipes. It's like, it's like shaving my toes. I don't do very good at it. You shave your toes? You don't? No. You don't they're not hairy. Toes? No, they're not hairy. Well, rub it in because mine are. Well, okay. <laughs> You're so cute. It's like I can't follow a recipe, and I do my shave my toes about as good as I shave my toes. As a well, okay. A recipe. I got you. Now where Your do we go? Where do we go from hairy toes? <laughs> I don't know. Is there anywhere to go? Yes, we're gonna go to old fifty. I fixed my. I fixed my hair. Have it. Honey, you look beautiful. But it fell down. You look beautiful. Because we had a hailstorm. You don't have any rain. And we got this two-hour rain and hailstorm and high winds and craziness. And it's crazy. Where did we get what? They said, where do we get those? Marilyn, what are you asking? Because I missed the question. Perry toes. And we, let's see. Perry toes. You get them from your mama. Every time. <laughs> they have hairy toes except for Dion which is okay yeah it is what it is 42 hairy toes and maybe I got weird hairs growing out of my neck too whatever whatever okay you, okay oh 57 you got it or you got sea glass what do you got I got oh 57 I got it I got sea glass too Okay, I'm here. I'm, I thought I had it in a cup, but apparently I didn't it's have that one in a cup. It's a cue break. It's a cue break. No, I'm, I'm, I'm here now. I, I just have to. Mama, you, my mama is on here laughing at me. Don't. It's true. My mama. It's true story. She, and yeah, and mama, she, mama, she blamed that hairy toe thing on you. Yeah, I don't think she. 
I don't know. I don't think that was her. I probably need to blame that one on my daddy. On your daddy. Yes, he probably had hairy toes. Yes. He did. Daddies have hairy toes, right? Oh, gosh. Oops. Okay, listen. In Debbie's video, she used liquid patina from the DIY line. On top of that, okay. she used a little bit of Old 57, Hey Sailor. She used a white. She used Farm Fresh, and then she used Golden Ticket, okay? Okay. So what she, this is the process. We mix it with, we didn't want to just use the paint, and so she mixed it with the liquid patina. It's just a clear, and it almost gives it a little bit more of a glue to where it, they don't, blend too much um without the liquid patina she said the colors kind of muddled together but the liquid patina gave it just enough glue and an adhesion is that a word yeah it is yeah. yes adhesion okay i like it and she she oh do you have water you Thank need a spray you, bottle I don't have a spray bottle. I have, but I can get. I can get one. Okay, you need to take a cue break because we're trying to follow these rules as close as we can. Yes, ma'am. I'm going. Uh, one moment. I'm gonna grab mine too. You guys don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. Sorry, we try to be prepared. Okay, I'm back. Look, it wasn't okay, seven that. miles across. The... That was Woo! more of a cue pause instead of a cue break. Yeah, I just hope there's some water. Is that enough water? Yes, you just need a smidge. You just need a smidge. You know what a smidge okay. is, right? You can measure that. Uh, yes, I do. I'm from Texas, so we know what a smidge is. Yes. And an eensy beensy titty tiny tiny bit. What What did you say? Did you say a naughty word? Uh, I don't think you did. What? I don't think you said a naughty word. What? Uh huh. What? Yeah, you did. <laughs> I heard it. Was 23 hard. years to go. We're almost at 100. Woo! Are we are? You guys are yes! awesome. I know keeps sharing. Everybody that's watching, we have 192 people. So everybody watching, y'all just push the share button. That's all you got to do. And and if you get, and if we reach 100 while we're live, um, Q's going to sing you a song. Right? Oh, no, no, I'm not. No, okay, no, no. Answer? I'm going to give. No, I'm talking. Can you answer the first um, trivia question, please? Me? Yes. Tell them the answer. Hello? I just wanted to make sure before I got in trouble. What? <laughs> I said I wanted to make sure I could answer before I, I got in trouble oh, yes, answering, you know? Yes, yes, Q. I want you to answer, and then I've got another question for these people that are okay. watching. So the very first Betty that was um, debuted and was born on December the 17th, I believe. Her, her, the name of her painting was Betty. Just plain old Betty. Trick question. Plain it was a trick old question. Betty. Plain old Betty. Mm -hmm. I thought you were going to sing. Uh, no. Oh. No. Nope. Okay, you can sing. Next. I don't know how to sing. Yes, you do. You sang "Happy Birthday" to Holden on here so beautifully. I had, that means I had to sing um, sultry ish. No, you have like Marilyn Monroe because otherwise there's no good tone. I have to whisper basically, okay. Okay. and I don't whisper well. No, no, it's not. It's not usually one of your. Um, mm -mm, no. Okay, moving on to number two. I can whisper. Okay. Okay. Um. What was? <laughs> oh, I got the next question. What was Betty missing? And Betty goes to the beach. She was missing something. No, no. Well, there's, are you doing the beach or Paris? She was missing stuff in each one. No, this is the beach. This is the beach. Okay, the beach one. Okay. Yes. I remember it very, very well. So. <gasps> we hit 100 saves. I mean, shares. Gosh, I cannot speak tonight. Well, we, won't, we haven't even started painting. We need to go to 200 now. You need to give away two paintbrushes. Okay, so we're at 210 viewing. So keep going, y'all. Keep going. Okay, now I'm going to say Hey Sailor with my big top. Okay. So I have Old 57 mixed, and now I have Hey Sailor, and I'm going to mix two more colors. Okay, Margie said a top. No, when Betty went to the beach, she had on a top. 
you guys, that's a, that's that's a different one. When Betty went to the beach, she was missing something, but it wasn't oh, her shirt. I see, I see the I see the answer. Cindy got it. At the beach, she was missing her hands, so the only thing she could do was poke, poke at the sand. She was poking the sand. <laughs> Q said she just had to poke. Good job, Cindy. Good job. I'll never forget that one. Trust me. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, girlfriend, you cracked me up. Okay, next color. I'm gonna oh. get a white. I'm gonna use beadboard. I don't. Okay. I don't remember if that's the correct white, but this is the white that I'm using. I'm sure Debbie Beard will. Still okay, be so I got my beadboard mixed up. How, how thin does it need to be? Thin or thickish? Or... Okay, did you watch the video, Q? I did. I'm just asking you for some um, additional guidance. Well, she said it had to be like pancake batter. Is this good? Uh, yeah. Gosh, dang it. Can we but it, mine are thin pancakes, right? <laughs> that happens to me every time I try to make them. I can't follow the okay. pancake recipe. I know, I know, and I follow it. I cannot follow okay. the pancake and then, okay. okay, so I'm going to have to, I'm going to add a few. Can I add a couple of colors to mine? Is that okay? Well, if you can, I can. So... Okay. <laughs> I mean, just, I mean, we don't have to. Just it's just, one. I had some. Just, uh, just pick one. This is our favorite. Look at, look here. This is our favorite color and we're not using it. Boho. Hello? Oh, yeah. Uh huh. I know. I thought about it, but then I thought I was going to try to follow the stinking recipe. Well, we can follow it. I don't have to use no. it. I have what we need. And then, no, you already we got have me farm excited. fresh. No, you already got me excited about it. Forget it. <laughs> Okay, what? Somebody said something about broken. What? Broken. Oh, we knew the rules would get broken. Ha ha. <laughs> right. You know what? It's not that. It's that she expanded our creativity through her video. We are so thoroughly inspired by Debbie Beard's amazing Amazing cheer technique. Yes, Q. And how many? She's got a thing for Q. How many years? She's got a thing you for sales. Q. Sales. Well, I didn't talk like that. <laughs> I don't know. I bet you did. Oh no, I did not. I talked just like this. Because I can tell you, talking Southern and you have the East Coast, it's a whole lot of fun. Oh, I bet you. Yes. Okay, I'm used to so. And I'm mixing okay, I've got farm fresh. Half, and I just spilled over the top of the stinking cup. Good Lord. Uh-oh. I have a bigger cup, I guess. Or not enough paint, whichever. No. So, yes, Annette, I was in sales pretty much since I was 13 years old. So, and I'm just 17 right now, so it's not been very long. Absolutely. That's exactly right. So, the third trivia question. You guys are doing awesome. I want to see how well y'all are paying um, attention to Betty. They're asking us if we finished our pieces from last week. No, we did not. No, we did um, not. One, I was, I was on vacation, actually, when I started the piece, and then I went back on vacation straight after that until, say, Wednesday. And so I have not had a time to completely complete mine. And so it will be completed this week at some point. Yeah, I haven't. Which I'm very excited about. I haven't either. Oh, you're welcome for the killer brownie recipe. Is it not delicious? You don't even know all that stuff is missing. It's so good. Okay, I'm I'm adding boho now. And then I'll have all my oh, colors. Goodness. I'll have all my colors ready. Okay. I don't know what's happened to my farm fresh. I think I accidentally got some blue mixed in it, so it's a little greener than what it's supposed to be. Okay. <laughs> That happens to me. Every, but I like it. That happens to me every. Day. That happens Look. every single day. They're saying that I'm hard to hear. Uh, they can't hear me. I know. Did you get your? Did you get a little microphone thing? Yes, I bought the microphone. Here's the problem. It has instructions. And I can't read them. No. Ha ha. That's funny. Q. No. Oh, Teresa Carr says I look thinner. Oh my gosh. Oh, uh, thank you. She's a winner, winner. I'm trying. I gotta lose thirty pounds. I'm trying so hard. You look, so hard. You look beautiful. Um, with the thank with you. the microphone. Here's the thing. I did buy one, and it works until you plug it in. 
Okay. For example, you would be able to hear me. Right. But I wouldn't be able to hear you. It, it's taking away the audio for me. Oh. So I decided, well, that's not going to work. So I'm not using mm -hmm. it. Sorry. I'm going to yell. No worries. What? You don't have enough to share? Protein. I'm eating a protein bar. Is that your dinner? <laughs> mm hmm Honey. Well, I had some turkey. You ate bird? I ate avocado and turkey. Mm-hmm. I know. You're a vegetarian. I ate a bird, man. <laughs> Eating animals. <laughs> you're going to make me spit this out. Hold on. Spit it out on TV. I want to see it. I want to see your protein bar. Oh, Lord. I don't think you do. Okay. What's the, now, what was the first color that she used? <laughs> You watched 57? the video, Q. We have a I did, but I didn't know I needed to remember it in order. <laughs> it's part of the recipe. All right, then you begin. Oh, you're going to blame me. Okay, fine. Here's the thing. Now, with the dark color and the, the, um, the liquid patina, the gold, she said don't use as much because what she found is with the darker colors, they really will take over. So... The lighter colors we're going to use more of, and the Hey Sailor and the Golden Ticket we're going to use the less of. Now we're gonna we're gonna do little strips because she just did lines, okay? Okay. And yes. And then she sprayed with water, and then she's gonna she tilted, and then we can we'll we'll divert the camera down, you guys, so you can see what we're doing, okay? Ready? Go. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Let's play. Can y'all see okay? I don't know why someone gave me an angry face, but I'm going to give it right back to you. I think it was an accident. Okay, can y'all see? Okay, there, can y'all see right there? I feel like I'm a little, I can't get any higher and I can't get any lower. Honey, it's, so, it's fine, it's fine, really. Okay. All right. I'm, okay, I'm, I'm a little bit nervous. Are you? Yeah, I don't know why. I mean, we. I what co it. What color are you? I start. What color are you using first? Farm fresh. All right, mine is so not that dark. Okay. What do you mean it's not that dark? I told you I think I mixed something with it when I was doing my cups. I had a, I had an incident. Oh lordy. Okay, so there's farm fresh. Now I'm going to grab some Hey Sailor. It's going to be my darker color. I'm not going to use as much of the darker color because Debbie said, do not use as much. So I'm listening. I'm listening to the recipe. It's a lot easier. Okay, you're doing, you're doing good. Thank you, sis. Uh-oh. Okay. Uh-oh. What? What happened? Nothing. What is that? Art? <laughs> Green. I told you something happened. Well, I like Let's 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 do your yeah. I like it. Okay, I don't know what I did, but I did it, and I did. And that's just that. That's that, and that's the way it's gonna be. Yeah. Cause fall line of recipes like beyond trying to shave her toes. <laughs> <laughs> so you're doing all of that. This is what, gonna take forever. This is what Debbie did in the video. Did you watch it, Q? Yeah, but, okay, so I just have a question. So she, you know, y'all know in the video, it, okay, oh my goodness, we have 257 people watching. Can y'all share this video? Tonight we're doing a poor Debbie's Design Diary has uh, released a new video on her YouTube page. So you guys, after this, go watch it and you'll understand what we're doing. And we're working with DIY paints. So um, if you'll you know, you need anything. I'm trying to look at the camera kind of in a weird way. Okay, I'm going to pour. So are you pouring everything? Yes. Okay. Yes. No. I'm going to, gosh, I'm trying to follow the rules, Q. Okay. I know. So here's the thing. I've got all this laid out. I'm going to add some water 
and get it moving a little bit and start some movement on my pour before I add my golden ticket, okay? Okay. Okay, here we go. I'm a, I'm I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna okay. I'm gonna do the Debbie. I better not get this mess on my shirt. Mm. <laughs> well, if you had a cute little apron I have, by, um, I have by Quita at All Shabbed Out, you wouldn't have a mess on your shirt. I do have, you know what, I have, I have aprons. I should put one on. Let me, let me do that now. I'm taking a deep break. Oh, really? Well, okay, well, I'm still pouring, people. I'm, I'm being really very slow. That's okay. We're watching, sister. We're watching. Okay. I got on my DIY mm -hmm. apron. Oh, I feel like I'm going to, I hope I don't mess this up. Someone says more white. Oh, Lord, I don't have no more white. <laughs> you need some? I got some extra. You know, I'm picturing, I'm remembering everyone screaming at us to use more water. More water, more water. Oh, my gosh. Did I? I had a nightmare about that. Well, I think I did, too. I got sent to the principal's office and everything. Well, I was right there behind you, right there holding your hand when we was waiting for her to come out. Oh, <laughs> Lord, that was scary. <laughs> this looks like junk right now. <laughs> okay. Ooh, what a mess this is going to be. I'm going to make this beautiful. I'm about to. Of course you are. Mm -hmm. You're a way better student than I am. I am a better student than you. <laughs> okay. Now I've got I've put got some said, I'm sorry. Put some flat somebody said put some flowers on it, Dion. Oh, you know I will. I'll be putting some uh, flowers going on. Okay, I'm gonna pour a golden ticket because this is already a liquid patina, so I don't have to mix it with anything, okay? I'm gonna pour the little okay. just a little bit here. Because everything needs a little bit of shimmer. Even even my toes. Speaking of, I gotta do them. Oh no. What's your what happened? Your water bottle got water is my water bottle malfunction. Not a malfunction except for the person who's operating it needs to add water prior to the live of the evening. <laughs> That's no problem. And then she took a little paintbrush or stick thingy and then what she she took something and she went like this and then she went like this. And then she went like this. Okay. How about a spoon? Can I use a spoon? Yes, you can. Because you're Queen Allen. You can use what you want. <laughs> oh, Queen Allen. Oh, Queen Allen. She's going to do what she wants anyway, whether I say no or not. Hey. Hey. I love you. Hey. I love you. I love you. <laughs> it doesn't change the fact you're giving me a hard time. I know. <laughs> So that's what I, that's what I, uh, that's what my kids say. Mom, mom, mom. They say something mean and then they say, I love you. Oh, yeah. No! <laughs> what? Hey. What just happened? Spilt a little bit. Well, it, it, on your shoes? No. Oh. I got on my work boots, so those are all right. Okay, good. Okay, if this can get a really messy. So Debbie did recommend a surface, but she put, she bought like this huge silver bowl theme of jigger, okay? And it was catching all of the pour, right? Well, I don't have that huge silver thing in my jigger. So I'm doing this, and that's just the way it is right now. I thought you was following all the instructions to a T. What happened? I told you I can't follow the instructions. <laughs> You didn't make it to the 99. We don't, I don't have no 99 cent store. <laughs> she did say it was 99 cents. She, whew, I, she did. I got a dollar store, but no 99 cents. So I couldn't find it. 
How's it going, Q? I'm just concentrating, just doing a little. I don't know what I'm doing. I think I need. I think I need something else. Okay. What do you? I think I need more white. Do you guys think I need more white? Tell me. Yes. You do. Okay. All right. Let's grab some more white. Hang tight, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, my white cup has been mixed with blue, of course. Q, are you still there? I am working away. Oh, I think people can't see the corner I'm working on. I don't, yeah, because I don't see that you're working on anything. <laughs> well, I poured some golden patina, I so I put it in. I feel like you're just copying me. I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> to watch me and copy me yes i'm copying you exactly what i yes that's what i do good grief q no shame in you or what no okay okay so i, I thought y'all could see my whole canvas but you can't can you can you um i don't know I'm trying to That's get a better I view. Understand. It's all right. We're going to be patient, aren't we, everybody? Yes. There it is. I see it. Okay. Okay. Right. I'm mixing half and half paint in the cup with um, DIY's dot big top to give it a little more. Um, it's going to keep it from blending too much. It's keeping all this separation. So this is a little bit of white. And I felt like it got too dark on me because it's probably the boho, but Q insisted we used a boho. Well, I didn't insist. It's just, you know, I don't have a lot of colors right now. It was a joke. And so I just, It was a joke. I just, oh, I don't have a lot of colors, and so I was trying to, trying to get something blue. I'm teasing you, sister. I know. I was trying. You're doing a fantastic job. Okay. Yours is pretty. Thank you. So now I have to add more water after I do this little shimmy shimmy thing that Q did. I mean that Debbie did. She went like this. You know, if you look on YouTube, there's a tons and tons of videos about paint pours. And so everybody does them a little bit differently. But Debbie was um, determined to figure out how to do it with our DIY paint. And it turned out so beautiful, you guys. It really did. And Debbie's videos are amazing and they're entertaining. Um, so once y'all are done here, if you are not ready for bed, you can pop on there and check it out. Okay, we're gonna start. Yes, we're gonna start. I'm sorry, I'm getting, I'm getting so in, all into this. I'm not. I'm just like not talking. So Jody just asked, "Are you mixing with Big Top or Liquid Patina?" So me, I'm, I'm doing Liquid Patina. I'm doing big top because I didn't have any liquid patina. And that's when I said I, I have a hard time following the rules anyway because it's like a recipe or shaving my toes. It never works out for me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love that. So we're just letting the paint kind of do its magic. We've applied a little bit of water, and this is all products by DIY. We're using a canvas, but Debbie actually covered a wooden seat um, with the white paint, and then she kind of gave it a base, and then she started in with the paint pour. And so now I'm going to go this way, and I'm going to let it start dripping. Of course, I'm letting gravity do its thing, and I'm starting to really, 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 really fall in love with this. But be prepared for the mess, ladies and gentlemen. Be prepared. Okay. So right now I'm thinking that I'm 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 so far at a B. I haven't hit the A, but I, so far I'm thinking I'm at a B B, maybe a negative. How about you? I think I'm at an A. Oh, sweet. <laughs> that a girl. That doesn't surprise me that you think you're an A+. Plus. 
I'm giving myself an A. Okay, I'm going to bring the camera in closer so y'all can see mine while it's drying because I'm pretty, oh, hello. I'm pretty happy with mine right now. I'm not going to lie. Okay. 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 Everybody else pretty happy with it? I think I'm pretty happy. And Q hasn't really got hers completely going and moving and shifting yet, but I'm pretty excited. It's going. No, I don't think I'm, I think I have it where I want it. Okay. I don't think I want mine to do that flow thing like that. But that's not the rule, Q. I don't like it going that way. <sighs> I don't want, you're I don't want it to go that way. You're going to get us back in the office. No, I'm not. It's hard. Oh, we're not following the rules. You know what? Okay, well, I'm teasing because Debbie would encourage us to actually do it yourself. That's why she created DIY as do it yourself. That's why. So I've got one more. Yeah. I've got one more trivia question for you guys. While mine's setting up a little bit, y'all can y'all can watch Q. Um, if I can get this to to work just a smidge. Okay, so. The third trivia question is this. Now, what has happened here? Goop, goopity, goo. I don't know what that means. Mm. And I apologize for saying that all the time. Thank you, guys. What are you I saying? think mine turned out fantastic. And I can't wait for it to really dry. But there's a whole lot of golden tickets. So the whole thing is just covered in gold shimmer. Um, okay, the third question about Betty. We're doing Betty trivia because... Um, Cute. It had such a do we all need to tell? Wait, do we? Do I need to tell who Betty is? Let me ask the question first. Okay. Because then I'll forget if I don't. So our right. third Betty question for those of you that know what Betty is, who that is, and have been watching us on all of our FNLs every Friday night. Um, who can tell me what pattern? We're on the shorts worn by Waylon when Waylon and Betty were together on the Had track. a Valentine's Day. There was date. a pattern on his shorts. What kind of pattern was the sh were the shorts made out of? Hmm? Tell me. Tell me. Tell me. Yes, Okay. That's your next question. Um... Okay, now Q, go ahead and explain who Betty is in case someone's on here for the very first time. Okay. So Betty is a stick figure whimsical piece of artwork that was born to teach Dion how to paint a Betty. Okay, we were doing a, our first canvas. I'm going to go ahead and put this up. <laughs> Bless you, Q. Thank you. Okay, we were doing our first Canvas lesson, and um, when we did that lesson together, I was going to teach Dion how to do a Canvas of some sort. And so whenever I came on that night, I had a very special Canvas that I had made out of this little abstract I had sitting over on the side. Well... That stick figure has now became a little fun trend that we do together. Yep. Um, Deb, Betty and I do together. And then D Dion is kind enough to let us have those on here every Friday night. And she's always doing some kind of adventures. She's been to Paris. She's been to Round Top. She's had a boyfriend for like a minute and a half. She has a girl dog named Kevin who she takes walks with. And um, let's see, she's been to the beach. And I'm trying to think. Oh, she's been in a bug. She got a love bug. So Betty likes cars because she got a she got the pick em up truck to go antiquing. And then she has a Volkswagen bug. And then her and the Kevin just cruising around with that. So <laughs> anyway, and so it's kind of turned out to be a fun little thing. I always do an abstract art and then I paint the Betty. That's beautiful. And then I paint the Betty over the abstract art and incorporate it with the colors and then I sell those and then I do a charity every month. So this month is St. Jude's and then also once the painting has sold, I trademark Betty 
um, since this started because it kind of got kind of silly. Not silly. I shouldn't say silly. That was the wrong word. It kind of got a little bigger than, right. you know, just a painting. Right. So, anyway, um, I did some Bettys. Oh, I have a Betty bag, a new one. Um, it's a larger canvas dark bag, too, from Round Top. So, it's adorable. Great for going antiquing. But um, I, I love doing them because I give, them, I'll give, them all, I'll give all the money to charity. And um, I appreciate y'all very much. And I do commission Bettys now. People have certain things they want Betty to be doing, so they contact me for that. So I love that. And so this, this month it'll be St. Jude's and everything will go to that. And tomorrow I will be at McKinney, Texas, um, doing a little demo out front of Summer James Boutique on the square. They're having arts in bloom and a wine festival. I'll be there from 11 to six or so. Yep. And I'm going to be doing some demos with DIY paint. And then I'm going to register people for my class in two weeks. So I hope you guys, if you're in that area, y'all come see it. That thing is huge. There's so many amazing artists there. And um, all of my stuff in my booth is 30% off except for the paints. But Awesome. Awesome. Will you give us a better look? They want to see yours a little bit better. Okay. I'll try without dumping it. Okay. Okay. Oh! You don't. You just want to leave it flat. You don't want all that movement, do you? No, I'm going to tilt it because I don't want it to move anywhere. I really I like it like it is. Okay. Okay. So as we Y'all see it? Yes, it's gorgeous. So you've got a little bit of green in yours. I don't think that was your intention. Well, yes, accidental, but yes, I do I have a little it. I love little it. Green. It's fine. Um, okay. And so just as a review, we, were, we watched Debbie's new video on Debbie's Design Diary, and we were totally inspired by her paint pour, where she used all DIY paints and products. Um, so much fun. This is totally easy to do. You just saw us, and I'm really happy with mine, and I'm going to give myself an A, an A plus, because I can, man. I don't know what you guys would give me. You're welcome to give me a grade, but if you give me anything lower than an A, you're not going to be my friend anymore. And so... <laughs> Um, I have my Hi. online class Sunday. If anybody wants to join me, we're doing the Monet finish in an online class. There's like 90 people and we're going to be in this group together. I'm going to paint a piece from start to finish. And then on April 28th, I'm having classes at Reclaim Warehouse. I have a class. I've got like 30 spots open. You guys come see me. Um, and then Hugh and I are going to San Diego. Yes. <gasps> We are going to San Diego, and I am so excited. Please sign up. Y'all come and see us. I know. You guys come see us in San Diego. We have like uh, 10 spots left. I don't even remember how many spots left. But, you guys, before I get off of here, um, and again, Q, I absolutely love that that apron. But, you guys, uh, my class is Sunday. My in-person class is on the 28th. Um, we're going to San Diego June 8th and 9th. And we sold like 20 tickets already. So people are coming out to see us and paint with us. And Debbie Beard of Debbie's Design. We are literally going to the DIY headquarters. Yes, we are. So, yeah, so we only have, so we have, we're, we're teaching for two days. Yeah. Okay. And we're doing three pieces of furniture each day. So me, Dion, and Debbie are all painting in those two. Is it a two hour class or three? It's three hours in order to get a piece per day and it's two hundred dollars yes yeah, two hundred dollars per day and it is not it's it's to show you guys all of the diy products yep. it's not it's not like a boot camp or retailer cop thing it's it's for you know the other people that want to come in and do it themselves, you know, well, and they want to learn that. So. Um, we're um, kind of targeting the San Diego area that's there around her shop in Solana Beach, California. Um, and, right. You know, any if anybody, you know what I mean? I, I think we sold a ticket to somebody in Illinois. Um, oh, yeah. yeah get on the plane. The tickets are cheap. Like, we have people coming everywhere. And so yeah. um, we have four new retailers, which I've decided I want to and make sure I announce them and um, get the word out that we have four new DIY retailers just this week. The week before we had six. The week before that we had five. The week before that we had four. Wow, we're growing. I know, we're, we're growing. growing so quickly. Kimberly and Marco Gonzalez have just around the corner. They're in Lincolnton, North Carolina. You guys now have a retailer, so get your DIY paint. Woo! Um, and then Judy Gray of Gray Lighting and Woodwork 
in Cashiers, North Carolina. That's two in North Carolina. You guys are getting. They needed them, and I know they need them. Yeah, they need them in South Carolina too. The Carolinas need our paint. They're because there's a lot of beach, and you know we have a lot of beachy. See, we have beautiful suns trucking in the sunset. Yeah, I know that Tammy <laughs> Oliver is there in South Carolina. I think she's in Myrtle Beach, and um, she has menagerie on the by the sea. Um, Michelle Kennedy of Divine Redesign in Hot Springs, Arkansas. We're happy to have you join our group. Um, oh, and then they're asking, hold on a second, sweetie. They're asking before I forget the ask question. They're asking about the paint classes and where they can get those tickets for your, the paint classes for California. Oh, on the turquoisecyrus.com. There are, um, 10 tickets available for the Friday class and I think 12 tickets or vice versa. So make sure you read the right date, but you go to the turquoisecyrus.com and you scroll until I think, you know, find the, find the ticket, put it in your cart and it's all yours. It reserves your spot. We have 20 for Friday and 20 for Saturday. And like I said, I think we've sold half. Um, yeah. So if you want to buy a ticket to my classes, they're also on there. And then Q, if you want to, if they want to come to your class, what do they do? Oh, they would just go on to summer James. Um, she, there's a link on my page as well. Summer James Boutique, and she has an online shop, and the DIY class is in there. And that'll be a two-hour class, and we're going to be mastering color. So that is really what our class is going to be about. Is all, I heard today that color is trending. Trending, honey. It's been here forever, and it ain't going anywhere. <laughs> I didn't know that it was it was not a trend. I thought it was a thing and it's in. Hey, if you don't have color, you're missing out. So last but not least, we have Sandra Lomas. She's with House 45 in Abilene, Texas. That's right. Woo! So Texas. Those are our retailers, you guys. If you um I'm gonna post my link here. If we don't have a retailer in your area and it's too far for you to drive, I'll post my affiliate link here and you can actually order it online and have it shipped right to you. Um, again, if you have any questions, go after you hang up here, hang up like we're talking on the phone. I'm sorry. Yes. Um, hanging up, hanging up on the TV, hanging up on the TVs. Um, this was our best attempt at Debbie's design diaries, newest video that she released on Tuesday. Um, we tend to have, um, our own style and our own ideas. And so we really, really, really tried to stick to her, um, interpretation and her teaching and her, um, instruction. However, um, following a recipe is not always my thing. And we have, as you know, Q said, we've got our own um, ideas, but I think we, I think both of them turned out really good. So we'll show a picture of them tomorrow when they're dry. Woo. I hope they, the hope that's dry. Probably. I wonder if I put the paint on too thick. <laughs> um, Q, Maybe not. Uh, what was the pattern of the shorts worn by Waylon? It was green plaid. Green. Yep. All right, I'm gonna pick a random name really fast. Hold on. All right, let's see. Okay, I'm just scrolling down. Um, while you're looking okay. there, you look there. Um, the Michelle Kennedy is with Divine Redesign in Hot Springs, Arkansas. They asked me to repeat that. Q. Okay. Lots of hearts yes. and lots of shares. Did we reach a? Did we reach our 200 shares? I think we reached, I don't know if we reached 200 shares, but I do know that we reached, um, oh my goodness, we reached 100 like I promised. Oh, that's fantastic. Look at me all acting all greedy and stuff. Shame on me. <laughs> oh no. What? I got paint all over where I don't want paint. Oh. On the floors. Oh no. Where's Carly? Carly's not here tonight. I uh, know. Okay. So I am picking a random person that I just scrolled through. And the person that is going to get the pixie paintbrush is Rhonda Benbo. Benbo. Ben. Benbo. B-E-N. B-O. Rhonda, send me a message. 
Okay. And I will send you a brush like right now. I'm going to go put it in the envelope right now. That is awesome. Okay. Rhonda is a lucky And I got to clean up this um, paint on the floor in a place I did not want paint. Okay. Well, we're going to have to let you go do that. I'm going to let all of you guys go. And thank you so much for joining us for our paint pour technique used by DIY Paint um, by Debbie Beard. It was her idea. And we just, we just had to try it. It's exciting. It's fun. I hope you guys all want to get after it and try it for yourselves. That's DIY for you, I tell you. Q, good luck tomorrow. I'm so excited for you. Thank you. It's Thank you. 11 to day. 6, I'll be in the kitchen. I hope it's a beautiful day, and I hope that wind is not mighty because I'm gonna, supposed to be out front. So I'm doing a couple little make and takes and for donation for St. Jude's, and then I'm also doing a community painting. Oh, how fun. I love that. Yeah. Hey, listen. Yeah. It's going to be windy. Don't wear a dress. That's my advice. Oh, and my other yeah. advice is shave your toes. You shave your own toes. I, I try. For God's sakes. All right. Get out of here. I love you. And I'll talk to you later. Bye. All right. Bye, love. Bye. Oh, gosh, the paint pour was so much fun, you guys. I'm going to give you one last look. It's drying. It's setting up just a little bit. That's the thing with the clay-based paint is it dries really quickly. Um, la -de da So this is my paint pour. I'm not going to hold it up like that too long. I think that the Golden Ticket added a lot of color, um, a lot of shimmer. Um, look at this. So you can do this as well with the DIY paint. I think it's awesome. I used um, Hey Sailor Farm Fresh Old 57. I used uh, Beadboard was my white. And then I also used the Golden Ticket. And because Q made me, she twisted my arm. Hello. I used just a smidge of Bohemian Blue. Um, and I mixed them all with DIY's Big Top because I didn't have the liquid patina. Nobody tell Debbie. Um, it's our secret that I didn't follow the rules exactly. Okay, Q did. She's a kiss up, I guess. But I didn't because I didn't have any. So let's just tell her I did and that I did this because she hasn't been on here tonight. So it'll be our secret, okay? All right. You guys take care and be awesome. I appreciate you. Have a wonderful weekend.